Welcome back to Actual Edge, your one-stop source for cutting-edge medical news. If you're new here, don't forget to like, subscribe and share to stay updated on the latest breakthroughs. Recently on our channel, we've explored potential cures for HIV, from innovative antiretroviral therapies to gene editing techniques like CRISPR. Today, we're thrilled to dive into some groundbreaking developments in this area. While the scientific community has been at it for over 40 years, the elusive HIV cure remains a global challenge. But a collaborative team from Aarhus University, Aarhus University Hospital and international experts including Dr. Paul Denton seem to be on the brink of a revolutionary breakthrough. The spotlight is on monoclonal antibodies against HIV. These aren't just antibodies that are synthetically designed powerhouses. Preliminary results indicate that this treatment might allow patients to suppress the virus for more than 3 months, with some even managing to hold it off for a staggering 18 months. Professor Olish Mel Sogard leading the charge sees this as a monumental leap forward in the quest to conquer HIV. However, it's essential to note that we're still on the journey. More research, trials and optimizations are needed. The aim is to have a future where a substantial proportion of HIV patients can lead medication-free lives. With the potential to redefine the existence of the 38 million individuals suffering with HIV plus those that have never diagnosed positive because of lack of testing facilities, preparations are in full swing for an extensive UK-led clinical trial and a broader European study. The road might be long, but the resilience and determination of these researchers stand as a testament to what human ingenuity can achieve. Keep an eye on our channel as we continue to cover this important research and much more. And don't forget to like, subscribe and share to stay on the forefront of the scientific innovation. Thank you for joining Actual Edge today, stay informed and we'll see you in the next video.